this last stretch right here straight stretch and then that's it we should be here I got a feeling it's gonna be a madhouse um, if it is I will turn around and I will go to the missile launch site which is pretty awesome as well it's literally 200 yards away so yep here we are yeah Folks, this is one of the best views in the United States. been here before absolutely amazing it's this to me is literally I mean this view from here <coughs> stands up there with you know Yellowstone and Yosemite it's uh, it's absolutely beautiful here Lake Superior um, and I know it's not coming out, but way out, there's an island, and there is a lighthouse. I'm hoping to see the, um, oh, that would be amazing. I'm hoping to see the northern lights tonight. They're, they're supposed to be pretty active tonight. So that would be, that'd be great. Um, 
Oh, he's doing good. He's done real well. Saxton's, I think, just being cooped up in the car has gotten to him. And he is being a little shit. Um, might be a female dog over there. That's how bad he's being. But all is good. Drinking a Keweenaw beer. Um, this is a cheers to my grandfather. Um, I would have never found this spot if it wasn't for him. And so I've truly fell in love with this and I will come back often. And every time I do, he will be with me. So cheers. Shadows are getting long, and uh, man, what a beautiful place. Let me take you out here. I've been, uh, you know, socializing, so to speak. Um, super nice people in the combi. And uh, these folks I met at a gas station on the way down. They got a little YJ, it looks like a 94, 95, somewhere in there, 93. Um, mm. I love this place. Very, very special place. And it has a lot of a lot of meaning to me this place I could have gone to core you know I'm sure I could have worked something out I just really wanted to come here it's still coming in it's still coming in Come on, Sykes. Good morning, folks. It's raining. Real good. You know, I've been real lucky. I've been here a few times. This is my fourth time. I've never encountered rain. So, paying dues. Boy, it's always hard to leave these places. It really is. I don't know that I'll ever come back, to be honest. Just hammered all morning, but it's starting to clear up. I can see beautiful sun rays coming through here. It's gonna be a nice day. Might take it a little bit to clear itself out, but it'll it'll be nice. Meanwhile, I'm gonna get on the road and drive this out of here. Um, I just I think I'm going back just to Carper Harbor and maybe try to get some breakfast. You know, I don't know, I know a lot of people from the internet, and I know this sounds crazy, but I feel like uh, the, I just saw somebody that I recognized from the internet. You know, the off-road world is kind of a small world, um, but I firmly believe that the, those folks in front of me, Badgerland, for some reason I'm thinking um, the name Jenny Arnold, Arnold, is that what it is, Arnold? Uh, blonde hair, dreadlocks. Yeah, I feel like she's in the Forerunner. But I think this is her Jeep in front of me.
this is the deepest mud hole on the hole coming in. able to catch up with those folks maybe I should just go into town and hang out you know because the truth is there's a lot of uh, amazing people in town that I you know I'd like to I'd like to meet I'd like to see so I may just do that I think I I'll just pedal down and I can come back out here I don't know where to where I'm camping tonight so maybe come back out here tonight What an amazing place. <laughs> 